7.32 billion pesos fund for COVID-19 response. The Secretary expressed his dismay over the release of the Commission on Audit findings. He admits to losing sleep because of shame. Secretary Duque also lamented that the issue has damaged the dignity of the DOH and its workers, including himself. Winarat na ninyo kami eh. Winarat na ninyo. Ang dangal ng DOH. Winarat ninyo ang lahat ng mga kasama ko dito. Hindi kami makaharap sa mga tao dahil lahat, ang dami-daming sinasabi, ang dami-daming paratang. Wala pa rin akong tulog. Ilang gabi na po ito. Kasi this is really unfair, unjust that this judgment has been handed down clearly without giving the DOH. But COA Chairperson Michael Aguinaldo defended the release of the audit report. He explained that this is a requirement by law. Aguinaldo clarified that they did not release any sensitive COA findings to the media. I just would like to clarify that hindi po kami nagre-release sa media ng mga adverse uh, audit findings or so. We do not. In fact, in my almost seven years in the commission, I think I have issued only not more than 10 press releases the entire time. And none of them had to do with um, telling uh, media the audit findings, except um, I think twice for performance audit. All the others were clarifications, and in fact, uh, there was one we issued with respect to the DOH audit report, where we said that well, among findings done, that money was lost due to corruption. The COA chief also answered criticism of President Rodrigo Duterte. We do not flag; <laughs> we just observe and recommend. Uh, the flagging is actually a term used by media. Pero kami hindi nag-flag because some of our observations are actually positive. The committee hearing has already suspended and the lower house will continue the hearing on Thursday, August 19. Arlene? Thank you, Nell Maribohok, reporting live.